Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Komal Kavar Shekhawat and I hope you all are doing great. In this video, I am going to explain how you can convert your yearly data to quarterly or monthly or bi-annually or weekly, right? Using EU software. So let's get started. So first of all, you need to import your data file in EUs. And you can see over here, I have already imported my data file. And this is the list of all the variables, right? And the data is annually from 2000 to 2019. And it is a panel data set, okay? Now, suppose, let's take a random variable. This is GDP, right? So if I double click this variable, you can see over here, this is the data for GDP from 2000 to 2019 for various countries that are taken into consideration for this panel data set, okay? But the important thing is this data is yearly data, right? Now, if I want to convert this yearly data into quarterly, let's say, so for that, you need to click on new page and there is an option specify by frequency or range. So select this option, you will see a new dialog box will appear in front of you. And here in the date specification, in the frequency column, you can see there are various options available, whether you want to convert your data to semi-annual, quarterly, monthly, bi-monthly, weekly, etc. Okay, so since this data was annually, and if I want to convert this data to, let's say, quarterly, so select that particular option and click OK. All right. Now what you need to do is again go to the previous window and here copy the data for that particular variable and open the new window that was created and then right click and click on paste special. Right. Now in the paste special, you can see over here the frequency conversion options. So there are various options available. So if you select specified in source, it means we have already specified that we want to convert this data from yearly to quarterly, right? So this is specified in source. And once you have selected this option, you need to click on OK. So now you can see over here, a new variable has been created. And if you double click this variable, you can see the yearly data has now been converted to quarterly. Okay, you can see over here for the year 2000, quarter one, two, three, and four. For the year 2001, again, quarter one, two, three, four, right? So this is how you can convert your yearly data to quarterly, right? Now, suppose if you want to convert your data to monthly, then the process is again the same. You need to click on new page and then specify by frequency and range. And here you need to select the option monthly because you want to convert your yearly data to monthly. And the time period is from 2000 to 2019. And then click OK. Right? Now, you need to copy this variable's data and paste this information in the new page. That is the untitled one window. And you need to paste the information. So select paste special. And the frequency conversion options are, so here you select specified in source and again click OK. So again, you can see a new variable has been created. And if you double click this variable, you can see the data has now been converted to monthly data. You can see for the year 2000, the data for month one, two till 12th. Okay. Again, then for the year 2001, the data is from first month to the 12th month, right? So this is how you can convert your data to monthly also. And there are various other options available like semi-annually, weekly. So you can select the required option. All right. Apart from this, you can also convert your data from monthly or quarterly to yearly. Right. So suppose this variable 
has a quarterly data okay you can see over here the data for this particular variable is quarterly now if you want to convert this quarterly data to yearly so for that what you need to do is again click on new page then select specify by frequency or range and you can see over here the data shows the frequency is quarterly right so here you need to select annual because you want to convert your quarterly data to yearly data right and then click ok all right now what you need to do is copy the information of the quarterly data and paste this information in this new window right so paste special and here you can see now you are converting your high to low frequency method. Okay, the frequency conversion option here is now you are converting high to low frequency, right? And the option that is need to be selected is specified in source and then click OK. All right, so you can see a new variable has been created. And if you double click this variable, so the quarterly data has now been converted to yearly data. So this is how you can convert your data from high to low frequency or from low to high frequency using EDUs. So I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Keep following. Have a good day.